Hi. Thursday again. Um, the 18th. It's Thursday, right? Um, a lot's going on. I thought a lot about what I mentioned yesterday, and this is the conclusion I've come to. My plan originally was, like I said, to tell my story and to how I came to Traumatire. And um, as far as organizationally, I had planned to take the latter part of the month to discuss more of the clothes. And um, so it's perfect timing that I heed um, the advice and recommendations of my doctor, but also stay to my desire and my commitment and, you know, I really did believe that this is what I'm to do, and I want to honor that. Um, so, we're going to finish the month out together, and I'm going to talk about a lot of the research I've been doing over the last couple of months on what um, textures and fabrics and placements of things um, really do help um, make people feel secure, um, protected, guarded. Um, as someone who struggles with PTSD, um, I spent a lot of time looking at the soldier uniform. Um, there's something about armor and feeling protected that um, I think some of the clothes I gravitate to um, just make me feel safe here. Um, and a lot of my designs have that kind of thinking. Um, but I'm kind of jumping ahead. Um, it's been a wonderful day. I've had all kinds of various productive things happen and sometimes productivity are just, just the greatest. Um, I'm going to Staten Island tomorrow, which is, if anyone lives in New York, there's only like one good thing that's come out of Staten Island and those are a great family, I know, but ugh, Staten Island. Um, but I'm going to Staten Island tomorrow for a Damon John, um, he is the FUBU founder um, the clothesline that came out a long, long time ago, um, For Us, By Us. Um, if you're not a person of color in their 30s, I don't even think you'd know what I'm talking about. Um, but anyway, he is one of the Shark Tank guys. He's the black guy in Shark Tank. So anyway, he is doing this entrepreneur workshop in like six different cities um, for free. And one of the, the events is in Staten Island tomorrow morning. Um, he may be there, he may not, but I am going to make the most of the opportunity and I'm going to listen and take notes and also maybe plant some seeds and see what comes of it. Um, you never know what can come of it. Um, so I had wanted to continue with my turquoise because it's just a color that makes me so happy. Um, and it actually is very much connected to anxiety um, awareness. And, um, but I just wasn't going to go out like that. So I went a little milder. It is, um, it was ultra strong violet on the box. And in the sun, you can definitely see um, some of the purple. But um, it's a little bit more conservative. So I compromised a little bit. Um, it's hot here. It's so hot. Uh, it's ridiculous. Um, and I don't do well in the heat, so I'm not going to stay very long. Um, but <laughs> Maggie, I love Maggie. Yes, she, of course, would be 40 and white and no FUBU. Um, but she's a special kind of wonderful, my Maggie. Um, so anyway, um, that's tomorrow. So I'm excited. I am trying to not have any expectations except to learn um, so I don't feel disappointed. Um, I had my first investor today. Um, someone believes in Traumatire and put their money where their mouth was and is writing the business a check, um, which is freaking awesome. Um, so that was crazy encouraging. Um, I spoke to some people at FIT today too. Um, thank you, Jasmine, um, for suggesting that as well. And I'm making moves. Um, so that's my decision. So over the next couple of weeks, um, I will be giving you a lot more drawings to look at, um, the thought process behind it, um, what kind of survivor I was thinking of um, when I 
drew it. Um, there are definitely some pieces that are more for survivors of sexual assault um, and others who struggle with panic attacks or anxiety attacks and just things in the clothing that could help you de-escalate um, if you're in the middle of having one. Um, so I'll keep you posted, but I'm excited. Um, I took my 50,000 units of vitamin D and then I went outside and got so much more vitamin D and it really has helped my mood um, once I cooled down. Um, I hope you guys are well and I will talk to you tomorrow. Bye.